In this Depressor Septi Nazi Muscle Accident Personal Injury Claim Guide, I'm going to be taking a look at some of the options available to you if you decide to bring a claim. If you have any questions, we have a free phone helpline where you can talk to one of our team on a no obligation basis where they'll aim to get you the help that you need if you've been the victim of negligence. Call now on 0800 652 7676 and one of our team will do all they can to assist you. So you've been involved in an incident which has resulted in a depressor septi nazi muscle accident. In order for you to bring a successful claim, you must be able to show that the accident was caused by the negligence of someone else. Let's say you've slipped on a wet floor in a supermarket and there was no wet floor sign. And it's the supermarket who will be liable in this situation as they have a duty of care as the business owner to provide a safe environment for their customers. Any compensation that you would claim would most likely be paid up by the supermarket's public liability insurance. Another example is if you've been involved in a car accident, let's say you were the passenger in a car that has been hit from behind by another car that failed to brake in an efficient manner. It is the responsibility of the driver of each vehicle to ensure that they are operating their vehicle safely and not putting others at risk. Even if the driver in front of them has been forced to make a genuine emergency stop, the fault driver should have ensured that there was adequate distance between their own vehicle and any others around them. When you make a claim, any payout would come from the fault driver's insurance company. Now that we've explained in basic terms how liability works and where compensation payouts usually come from, let's take a look at some of the reasons which you may be bringing a claim for a depressor septi nazi muscle accident. General damages. Now this is the award for the injury itself, be it physical pain or psychological injury. Care costs. If you need assistance with taking care of yourself as a result of your injuries. Medical costs. All medical costs that you have to pay as a direct consequence of the accident to treat your injuries. Travel costs. Any travel expenses you've incurred as a direct consequence of the accident. Loss of income. A compensation claim for loss of earnings due to the accident and also the potential future loss of earnings due to ongoing health issues are encountered as a result of the injury sustained in the accident. In order to increase the likelihood of a successful claim for compensation for your depressor septi nasi muscle accident, we recommend that you act as soon as possible. This will make the evidence gathering process much simpler. This includes things like obtaining CCTV and witness statements and ensuring, if possible, that an accident report form is completed. So the sooner you begin the process of bringing a claim, the more likely you'll be able to win the compensation that you're entitled to. It's always difficult to estimate how much compensation you could be entitled to for a depressor septi nasi muscle accident, as all accidents are different. But we're happy to tell you that as long as you've not already instructed another solicitor to look after your claim, one of our team will be able to talk through your claim with you in order to help you establish just how much it may be worth. So how do you bring a claim for a depressor septi nasi muscle accident? We believe that one of the most efficient ways to bring a claim is to instruct someone who has experience and knowledge in dealing with these types of claims. The good news for you is that legalexpert.co.uk offers a completely free, zero obligation consultation. We will talk through your claim with you in order to help you establish what your options are. If you do decide to bring a claim to us, we'll do all we can to ensure that your claim is as successful as possible. And the best part is that there's absolutely nothing to lose, as if we do take your claim on, it'll be on a no win, no fee basis, meaning that there's no upfront fees. And as long as you're honest in your account of how the accident occurred, if your claim isn't successful, there won't be a penny to pay. Call now on 0800 652 7676 and one of our team will do all they can to assist you. They'll be happy to discuss typical payouts for personal injury UK, back injury compensation payouts UK, soft tissue injury compensation calculator, personal injury claims calculator, personal injury claim settlement process, what happens if I lose my personal injury claim, soft tissue injury claim value and official college guidelines personal injury. Don't forget to subscribe as we'll be uploading helpful videos just like this one on a regular basis or you can head over to legalexpert.co.uk where you can read community questions on our forum, get free advice on our live chat and seek assistance for compensation on a no win no fee basis with your personal injury claim.